The Florida Forest Service has 29 firefighters assigned to the Yellow Bluff Fire. There are also 13 bulldozer crews, fixed wing planes, and helicopters dumping water on the fire. The U.S. Forest Service and JFRD are also helping. Now, because of the marshy conditions in that area, firefighters are having a tough time getting close to some parts of the fire. Action News Jack's Alicia Terracon shows us the St. John's River Water Management District brought in some special equipment that can go where no other machines can. Jeremy Olson works with the St. John's River Water Management District. On Saturday, he was called in by the Florida Forest Service because of his access to a very specialized piece of equipment, the Marsh Master. Forestry worked really closely with us, and, and so they, they knew we had this machine, and so they were giving us a heads up that, hey, um, starting today, we're going to, this would be a good time to move this onto this fire. St. John's River Water Management District tells us this machine is sort of a mix between a pontoon boat and a bulldozer, and it's able to go into these marshy areas where bulldozers can't go. The Marsh Master has the ability to put out fires too. Using the machine's tracks and its sharp roller chopper, it's able to push down these thick shrubs. It's wet underneath the vegetation, and so once we mash it down, it'll kind of make a, a fire control line that way. This is a map showing where the Marsh Master is established. Those fire lines along the northern marsh areas where the Florida Forest Service couldn't get to earlier in the week. Once Olson finishes with an area, fire crews come in and spray the smoldering pieces of wood with water, preventing any flare ups from happening. Reporting in Duval County, Alicia Terran Con, CBS 47, Action News Jacks.